So, in terms of the midterm, I think the customer is very bullish. So, we are building up the capacity. By 2025, in US alone, we are going to reach 100 gigawatt hour capacity a year. So, the new models are coming up continuously. So, the important thing is about innovation and the technology. So, for example, this generation we are providing to BMW is going to be the highest performance. So it's going to be 20% energy density improvement, 30% range extensions, and also 30% increase on the charging speed. So highest performance, at the same time, is going to be lowest emission. The carbon emission compared with current generation is going to is going to be 60% reductions. So you can see technology is going to change the equation. It's going to drive more supplies, drive more performance, really make the electric vehicles become more competitive and more environment friendly. Lei Zhang, tell us what you're doing in the market that is paramount globally, and that is China. You mean the global market or Chinese market? The Chinese market, yes. The Chinese market, I think, is, uh, if you can see, end of this year, so this uh, new penetration for electric vehicle could uh, reach uh, 30%. So the speed is really accelerating. And uh, which this kind of fast speed is going to drive innovation is, is in a dramatic way uh, from the, for the entire value chain not only battery cell, also battery materials, also the new battery technologies. And also this build-up of the supply chain is going to reduce the cost of battery, especially, you know, uh, not only build up the battery, manuf- battery cell manufacture, but also the upstream development of the lithium mine, nickel mine, precursor, cathode. The entire value chain is now being stimulated. So we could see... Uh, potential easing on the up